Imagine this frightening situation. You're on a first date, in the car together, and your date refuses to take you home. You're on the road for several miles, unable to escape. Well, that's a situation a local woman says she was in on Sunday. WFMY News 2's Hannah Jeffries spoke with investigators about what happened. It was more than just a bad date. It's definitely a bizarre set of circumstances, um, and thankfully it doesn't happen too often. The Rockingham County Sheriff's Office got a call from a woman claiming the man she was on a date with refused to let her out of the car. Shortly after, deputies started searching for the car that matched the woman's description. Right place, right time. Um, when the call was dispatched, he was in the area 14. He decided to uh, make his vehicle stationary and just keep an eye out in the area. The deputy tried to pull the car over. The car eventually stopped a few miles down the road at a gas station. She was clearly in distress, ran over to the cashier there, the attendant at the gas station, stayed over there while the deputy gave him commands to exit the vehicle. If you're ever in a situation like this and need to be more discreet, remember there are ways to reach out for help without having to dial 911. 911 centers uh, these days are very advanced. Uh, you can text the 911. Uh, most of the phones have an emergency or distress button um, that you can hold down and it'll automatically call 911 for you. Deputies say you should keep your guard up, especially at the beginning of a relationship. At least for the first few dates, uh, as you're getting to know the other person, to meet at a uh, public place. Both of you drive separately, that way either one can leave at any time. The sheriff's office charged this man, 44 year old Garrett Wheeler, with second degree kidnapping and false imprisonment. Deputies say the char these charges come on top of Wheeler's extensive record. He's currently at the detention center under no bond.